bitch. How many of them? Three Havocs and four! No, five of my seventeens! Commandos fast roofing down! Get the fire team on the roof! Yuri! Yuri! Over here! We need to get sunk to the chopper! What is that? Shit, we my favorite character. Keep your eyes on the coach, y'all. Oh, the Desert Eagle. Let me just try real quick. Take the coach off. Take them down. Oh wait, let me, let me just try this gun for you all. We need to hold them off until we can move so. Usually against the ACOG stuff, but uh, they are kind of far away, so it's good. Oh shit, what is this? You guys, but I fucking hate needles. They're on the roof. We've got to get soaked to the chopper. Yuri, you with me? Yuri, over here. Look at friends, tail guys. This gun has zero recoil. Holy shit. What gun is this? Oh, M4 holographic. Oh shit, oh shit, watch out! They usually put intel just like in weird areas, I don't know. Well the G36C was a gun that they finally brought back. It's one of my favorite guns in Call of Duty 4, but... Be a nice little place for it. Oh shit. There we go. I knew they'd put one right here somewhere. Just a random little alleyway. <laughs> game handles if it, if you want like a short review wait what the fuck was going on that this one oh, I'm gonna reload this thing slow reload so I guess this is a light machine gun see what this one was we're outnumbered and outgunned we need some heavier firepower there's a weapon cache at the edge of town we have a UGV stored there then we use that to get to the chopper. Let's go. Hold fire, civilians! Oh shit. I'm trying to get that guy behind him. Why do they all look the same? Holy shit. Fucking suiciders and shit now. I could drive that thing, that would be sick. Look out for any intel, guys. I'm sure I'm gonna miss a few, but I'm trying to see if I can get most of them. <laughs> Roger, watch the 
Get my other gun back. by the layout. Fuck, I'm cornered. Come on in, man. Help me the fuck out. One, two, three, and fuck you. Oh, shit. He's about to take it deep. There's a gun right there, but uh, I don't see anybody on it. I like this gun, but it definitely needs extended mags, so. We just picked up an intel over there. Let me look up here. Sometimes they'll put them back to back, which is kind of rare, but you never know. <laughs> Check down there already, I think. Just doubling back, guys. You never know. Yep, alright. I think I got all the ones right here. Go ahead and reload just to be safe. Checking all corners. I have to. I got you. This guy knows there's some intel. This. I know he does. Hop over grandma. Nope. The fuck is that guy doing? Somebody's basement again. So far, so good, guys. Shit. Unmanned ground vehicle. Two centimeter armor plating, mounted minigun, and grenade launcher. Controls are gonna be in Russia. Yuri, you're up. Right. What's such condition? We've gotta get him out of here! 
Yuri, clear a path to the chopper. We'll be right behind you. Holy shit, I'm about to drive this thing. The minigun will punch right through walls. I've got to give you one of these. Shit they used on uh What is it? Uh I can't think of the name of the movie. It's got Gerard Butler and uh Jamie Foxx. Except it was sniping. Oh shit. Yeah, take it, bitch! Alright, yeah, I got a long way to go. Watch out, Bryce! Watch out! My bad, bro. Mini gun is disgusting. Holy shit! Where the fuck am I getting shot from? Time to go, time to go.
They say truth is the first casualty of war. But who defines what's true? is flying to Hamburg to negotiate a peace treaty with NATO delegates. Truth is just a matter of perspective. However, many Russians still blame America for the massacre at Zakaev Airport. The duty of every soldier is to protect the innocent, and sometimes that means preserving the lie of good and evil. The war isn't just natural selection played out on a grand scale. But for now, it looks like the world may finally know peace. The only truth I've found is that the world we live in is a giant tinderbox. All it takes is someone to light the match.